but if we follow the actual orbit, it does not. Thanks very much. The local narc, Catfish Corners, just keeps trying to tell you all this absolute nonsense. Three pictures all in a row, and I made it look like it was rolling, but then I explained it isn't because you're looking at it wrong. You have a 90 degree difference when you look east and a 90 degree difference when you look left. It looks like 180 degrees, but if you actually follow the orbit, it never rolls. Thanks very much. My name is Lee. I follow the Christ. And science is really easy, but stupid line marks just can't seem to let go of when they're wrong. So unless... <laughs> now, there's no one less about it. I just proved the moon isn't rolling. Thanks a lot. Bye. So there we go, brothers and sisters. Uh, there's liars for Satan out there. Uh, this was a pretty simple thing to explain that a uh, four-year-old should be able to understand, but apparently the catfish cannot understand it because he's a liar for Satan. And everything he's ever said, uh, the woo that comes out of his mouth about the moon rolling because there's some other sun in the sky is obviously deluded nonsense because he says there's a black sun out there, a dark star because it's a uh, ultraviolet one. Well, that means then that it's a uh, ultraviolet star. It means it's not red. So there's no red kachina, it's an ultraviolet. And there's no blue kachina because it's an ultraviolet because you keep saying that they're invisible. But if they're invisible because they're black light, then the best they're going to be is purple because that would be coming into the visible spectrum. But to sit there and say that a red kachina and a blue kachina are actually a red and a blue sun, but they're both invisible because they're black light means they are not red and they are not blue. I just thought I'd throw that in because you're twisted, confused, nonsense telling people about there's a red sun in the sky and a blue sun in the sky and yet then you say that it's a black light means it's not red and it's not blue because those are light spectrums whereas the uv light is invisible to human eyes so you saying it's invisible but then saying it's a red star and a blue star contradicts everything you say everything you say is pure nonsense and i hope everybody realizes that okay so there we go i put Three pictures in a straight line. I made it look like it was rotating by looking at it wrong, by changing the angle of my viewing. And then when we follow the orbit, we find out that the moon's not rotating at all. <coughs> Thanks very much. I do hope that people understand right from wrong, lies from truth, and fact from fiction after this video. <laughs> I'm sure they will. Oh, shit. I wasn't going to say a word. I didn't have to. He said enough. This took me five minutes to look for, or less. I don't know, that's probably, I mean, it was less than five minutes I had this. See the level of research he does? Versus simple, like, like and this game. Hmm. Ultraviolet, blue sun. I'm sorry, it's a blue star. Maybe that's the problem. Semantics. Is that it, Lee? <laughs> I don't think so. I think you're a fucking narcissist. And I'm gonna fuck your mother. Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> Yo! Come get breakfast, Lee. <laughs> oh. oh, hi, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, that's some funny shit. Oh god, I gotta get out of this. Why'd you kill a fucking thing? This is good.